Hi, my name is Noel Menes. I own and operate Oakheart Forge, a real small operation located in Chico, California. You can find me at oakheartforge.com or on Instagram under oakheart underscore forge. I make uh, handcrafted swords and knives. I do everything in shop. I don't outsource any of my work unless I'm working with another artist in a collaboration. I, this is a Celtic, Bronze Age Celtic sword form with Iron Age ornamentation. It's a bog oak sheath and handle. The handle is a piece that is 5,600 years old. I use lost wax bronze casting where I start off carving everything in wax and then I make a plaster mold around it, melt out the wax and cast and pour in molten bronze and you're left with the final piece, take a little cleanup and then the assembly leaves you with a really nice piece. It's a 320 layer Damascus steel. I, as I said, make the Damascus in shop. With, uh, I use a power hammer to do a lot of the heavy lifting. Have a series of apprentices working with you so that you could have, uh, you know, you can move, move a lot more steel when you've got uh, four or five guys hammering on it, but without that, the uh, use of modern machinery can uh, really save you a lot of time and effort. It's a random pattern Damascus, uh, 15 and 20 and 1084 high carbon steel. I've been working on it for three and a half months, working full time. It's um, sword in this style would go for right around $10,000. Um, probably make uh, only one or two of these a year. It takes a lot of effort, and it, it takes it takes something out of you. Every every piece is uh, left with a little bit of you. Here's uh, my knives. A little little contrast. Some simple hunters. So, uh, nice little trail knife to keep on your side while you're out in the bush. 390 layer Damascus steel. It's brute de forge finish where after I make the Damascus and forge it out into a bar, I'll forge the uh, blade into shape and then the spine and ricasso area are left with the forged finish and the, then you grind the steel down and do an etch to reveal the Damascus. The handle is curly maple with uh, little brass fitting. It is a hidden tang, which means that instead of the full tang where you see the steel coming out, it's with uh, the tangs just within and uh, peened over on the end. It makes for a nice sturdy little camp knife. I make uh, these nice little leather sheaths for them, hand tooled and sewed sewn and they uh, and try to make them tight enough to where when you're running around out in the bush they're not gonna just jump out on you so it's a boot dagger the um, handle is uh, made out of elk antler it has a, um, a frame lock handle where the the tang is like a hidden tang inside and then you have uh, stainless steel wrapped around the end and I did a little bit of file work on there on the end and just pinned it up concave back so that apparently what I've heard is uh, that stick somebody with it it causes a wound that does not close up so it's uh, as deadly as it is cute <laughs> So again, you can find my work online on Facebook. If you look up Oakheart Forge, or you can go to oakheartforge.com and find me on Instagram under oakheart underscore forage.